Hello everybody, AFV here, also known as Mystic the Elling. Before I start to get into my Leafwing Rainwing analysis, I want to first say that I'm sorry I haven't been here this past week and a half. I've just been really busy, tired, don't know what to post, although I have been brainstorming on a lot more OCs. That's probably what the next video is going to be on. More OCs, thoughts, ideas, not exactly stories, I don't know what I'm going to do yet, but I just want to throw some ideas on that out there. But anyway, this is Wings of Fire analysis between Leaf Wings and Rain Wings. This isn't exactly a theory, but I just wanted to throw it out there, give you guys an idea. I'm not sure how many people have thought of this or if anybody has, but I almost want to say that Leaf Wing designs are off of Rain Wings or they're copying Rain Wings. Now, the looks are obviously very different besides their lean bodies. But before we get into that, just don't bash me in the comments, all right? I'm going to get to the point. But in Pyrea, all the tribes are based off of elements, like sea wings have evolved and adapted to the ocean, and how sand wings have evolved and adapted to dry and hot circumstances or areas, or whatever you want to call it. Leaf wings, we don't know how they've evolved, but they've pro they're have they obviously based off of plants, and I heard Tweety Sutherland say in an interview, or in the Wings of Fire Wikipedia, that they are basically an, an expanded idea on grass wings. So, the in Pentella, the tribes that are based off of there are more insect-based, how silk wings are based off of butterflies and moths. And hive wings are based off of hives and bees, wasps, and, you know, other insects. Cricket, for example. And what I see here is that there is one tribe in each continent that's a little different from the rest. Obviously, we can see the differences with the leaf wings. And, like, because they've got two wings, they're more um based off of an element not really a real creature or animal insect in this case and i'm not sure if rain wings are based off of animals because their abilities like their venom is based off of snakes the color changing scales is more inspired on chameleons but rain wings have adapted lived grown evolved to live in the rainforest. See, like, they know, like, a lot of foods there, animals, how to live there. You know, they can, like, dodge trees. That's kind of what they're for. Leaf wings are more based, based off of plants, but if they were to live in the rainforest and for just a little bit, get used to the environment a little bit more, I'm sure that leaf wings would get into what it's like to be a rain wing right away. But there is the poison jungle, and a jungle is a uh, warm, moist, really leafy environment. So, are leaf wings basically being, well, how, how should I say this? Like, are leaf wings a copy of rain wings? Like, are they copying rain wings? <laughs> this is a really strange like question to ask but I mean I almost want to say yes because I mean their looks and abilities are obviously quite different but I mean there's those one tribes in each continent that are just very different from the others it's like are if rain wings are adapted to the rainforest even though they do have animal abilities they don't really look like animals Although, I will have to say that their frills are probably based off of frilled lizards. Uh, and But anyway, like, leaf wings, like I said earlier in the video, live in jungle, in the jungle. So, it's just a thought I wanted to put out there for you guys. I'm not sure if this, this doesn't really conclude, conclude anything. I just wanted to throw it out there for you guys. But... Anyway, that's just my opinion. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. My next video should be on other OCs. I'm probably going to have, like, 30-plus OCs. I've been trying to brainstorm on some hybrids for a little bit. I've got two 
in my head ready to share with you guys, but I'll do that in the next video. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. I'll see you later.